time to learn a little. In a few years, you will know a lot. But doesn't your brain get full? Oh, Freddy, your brain is not like this watering can, which gets filled up. And emptied out? Oh, right. You know, Johnson had that same thought one time, and it made him real sad. Well, what happened? Well, let me think. How did it all start? <laughs> Johnson loved thinking. Recently, he had taken to thinking in a big way, and even had a special thought for every day. But the other toys were quite tired of it. Oh, oh no. It's time for thought for the day. <laughs> wow, another thought. I can't believe there could be so many. I hope this one is a short thought. We haven't had a short one for weeks. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Johnson. Let's hear your thought for the day so we can get on with something more interesting. Ooh. Like, like, bumps and bumps. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think you want to hear the thought for today. In fact, I don't want to hear the thought for today. Oh. Why not, Johnson? It's the worst thought uh, I've ever had. Oh, no. Oh. Johnson, no thought can be that bad, can it? Oh, you just wait and see. Mm -hmm. So Johnson led the toys across the floor and talked about the worst thought he'd ever had. Now, we all know everything gets full. Look at Michael's waste paper basket. It's full of paper. It's always full because Michael never empties it. <laughs> Michael's drink container is full, too. Full of drink. What are you getting at, Johnson? Yes, Elephant, get to the point. Well, uh, perhaps if I think too much, my brain will get full, too. And I won't be able to think ever again. Oh, don't worry, Johnson. That's not possible. Is it? Uh, I'm not sure, McDuff. Follow me. Imagine Michael's boot is my brain. Oh, yes, Johnson, I can see the resemblance. <laughs> and this container is full of my thoughts. Oh. Now, as I start thinking, look what happens. See? I'm thinking and thinking. Oh. And thinking. Your brain's really full already, Johnson. And thinking and thinking. Yes. And thinking. Oh. are spilling all over the floor. Exactly. And that's what's going to happen to me. Oh, I'll fill up my brain and, and my thoughts will come pouring out my ears. <gasps> and I won't remember anything. Oh. Oh, we've got to help Johnson. Yeah. I've never seen him so sad. Oh. So the toys got busy working out a way to find out just how many thoughts were in Johnson's head. Not that way, this way! All right, all right. Now switch it on. Switching on now. <laughs> it works! I'll tell Johnson. Uh, uh, Johnson? Yes, Alfred? What is it? We've discovered how to work out if your brain's full or not. <gasps> how? Ready, Diesel? Mm -hmm. Ready, Alfred. With our thought detector! Ta -da! Amazing. Come along. There is absolutely nothing at all to be nervous about. Mm -hmm. Now, you see how Michael's flashlight will shine through anything that is empty? Yes. Good. Switch off the flashlight, Macduff. Switching off flashlight. 
So, Johnson, if you sit down here, then mm -hmm. we'll shine the flashlight through your head to see if your brain's empty or not. Are you sure this is safe, Alfred? Uh, possibly. Now, turn around. Ooh. Switch on the flashlight, Macduff. Switching on flashlight. Ooh. Ah! I can't see any light. Your brain must be full already, Johnson. It could be my stuffing. No, no, it's definitely your head brim full of thoughts, ready to come bursting and leaping out of your ears. Oh, no. Oh, you'll have to stop thinking, Johnson. You'll have to ration yourself to one thought a day, just like me. No more, no less. Mm. Mm. Uh, yes, I think that's a good oh, no, idea. No, no, no. They've been thinking again. No. Oh, we'll have no. to stop it here somehow so uh. the thoughts will stay in. What am I going to do? Oh, I don't know. Oh. Johnson tried to stop thinking altogether, but found it very, very hard. Not thinking. Uh-oh, oh. you're not trying to think again, are you, Johnson? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you -hoo. Oh. Goodness gracious me, what's happened to Johnson? He thought too much and his brain got full, and it could overflow at any minute. Poor thoughtful elephant. I hope it isn't catching. How's he doing? Psst, Diesel! Huh? Diesel? Well, I've stopped him thinking, but he's not very happy. Oh. 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 oh, oh, oh. Careful, Johnson. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, oh. oh no. He's having another thought. Make... Uh, I'm starting to think. No, 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 no. Oh, what are we going to do? Oh, I'll help him, Diesel. Johnson, don't think that thought, whatever you do. Uh, shush. 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 Oh, my. What's he going to do now that he's not allowed to think? I don't know, Victoria. I don't know. Now, put one foot in front of the other. One foot in front of the other. Good. <sighs> now the other foot. Lift. Now the other foot. Good. <sighs> there. Was that so hard? Uh, I'd, I'd rather do it myself, actually. But you're not allowed to think, remember, Johnson? No, but I can't stop, no matter how much I try. Oh, why don't you just have a seat and watch the sunset? Mm. <sighs> Isn't the breeze nice? I suppose so. It's funny. This bedroom is full of air, right? Yes, Macduff. And the breeze is full of air, too, yet it keeps blowing into the bedroom. How could that be? Well, the window's open, of course. <laughs> but you said everything gets filled up. But there's always room for fresh air here in the bedroom. Macduff! That's the best thought I've ever heard! <laughs> oh, no! Don't advantage your brain, Johnson! <laughs> My brain's fine, Macduff. <laughs> there was never anything wrong with it. Huh? I bet it's just like this room. No matter how much I think, There'll always be plenty of room for fresh thoughts. <laughs> After that, nothing ever again stopped Johnson thinking. And when he wasn't thinking, he was dreaming of all the thinking he would do in the months and years to come. <laughs> Just a small toy elephant, pink and round and fat, and not too brave. But I could be anything, I could be anything, I could be whatever I crave. I think I'd like to be a great philosopher. I'd be smart and wise and have my say. I'd publish many books of my discoveries. I'd be paid to sit and think all day. I'd be special friends with famous presidents. The queen would ask me in for scones and tea. I could be anything. I could be anything. But just today. I might stay me. <laughs> <laughs> Sonny, Sonny! Sonny, do you know what I think? What's that? I think it's time for Mumpy! Oh, great idea! 
When we last saw Mumphy, he and Scarecrow flew away from the island using the Queen's magic umbrella. Later aboard Whale, Mumphy, Scarecrow, and Mrs. Admiral were being chased by pirates. The 